here on stream one beating Andy Bolton Paul Nicholson talked you through that one I'm Chris Murphy taking you through this meeting between Humphreys and Clearmaker and the big news of course if you are just joining us is that Michael Van Gerwen was beaten in the first round will not be making it three out of four this afternoon 96. Peter Wright and Gerwin Price still going strong Forty-three. Price seeing off Steve Brown 6-3 in the second round. Right to 6-0 winner against this Scottish compatriot John Henderson. Nathan Aspinall also a 6-3 winner against Simon Whitlock in a brilliant match in which both players averaged 26. over 104. Oh, but on the other stream, if you've been watching that with Dan Dawson and you've switched to this 140. one, you would have seen Glenn Durant beating Stephen Bunting 6-1. That result significant for the world match play. It means that the top 16 seeds are now set in stone. The identity of them, at least, if not the actual seedings. 45. Luke Humphreys does have a, a chance to make the match play with some progress this afternoon. So he'll be wanting to get off to a good start. This would be a sensational Game start. Shot. What a start! From Cool Hand Luke, a 158 checkout to break the throw and steal the opening leg. One hundred and forty. Humphreys has 100. had some tough draws in the first few days here. Beaten by Chris Dorbion. Day one in the first round, Ryan Joyce in the second round on day two, and Gerwin Price in the first round yesterday. Average 101.7 in his opener against Steve Beaton this afternoon. A 6-3 success for Humphreys. Who twice topped the development tour order of merits before 40. being crowned world youth champion last year. 95. 25 years of age from Newbury. Certainly uh, an exciting talent. We've seen him on the Premier League stage as one of the challengers, stroke contenders last year. Did himself 90. no harm at all with his performance in drawing with Gerwin Price. Quarter finalist at the Ali Pali. Game shot. He's made a flying start to this match. Twenty-three. Couldn't find a way through there. Martin Clearmaker. The Dutch. Giant, 180. Who beat Rob Collins in his first match this afternoon. Reached the quarterfinals on day two of the summer series. Lost out to Dave Chisnell, the eventual runner-up. After beating Christoph Ratajski and Jason Lowe in consecutive matches. 60. No mean feat. That also had a win against Gerwin Price on the opening day. So some positives for him to take home to Holland. 55. But it is Humphreys who is bossing this one in the early exchanges. 140. Puts himself in a decent position. MK in MK. 134. Double 19, that's wayward. Game shot. But he's managed to correct it and make the necessary adjustment. The checking out in this match has been fabulous. 158 and 81 for Humphreys, 96. followed by a 98 for Clearmacher. 100. Nice pace to this game. Really is rat-a-tat-tat -tat stuff from the pair of them. 
180. And very good standard. 140. Racking up a couple of 180s to aid his average, which is up there, look, at 107 almost. 100. Both men in three figures after three legs. 140. Our round three match here will be between Daryl Gurney and Devon Peterson. Stay tuned for that at the end of this one. The match choice over on stream two will be Peter Wright 23. against Ricky Evans. Right then, can he clean this up? Bullseye. Game shot. Oh, wonderful stuff. It goes on. Sublime stuff here. 2 0 lead for Humphreys, thanks to two combination finishers, including a enormous 158. 68. Clearmaker has hit back with 98 and 121 on the ball to force deadlock at two apiece. 100. Sixty. Standout result no, from the second round is the six three win of Callan Rids over Ryan Searle. Rids averaging one hundred and five in that victory. Not for the first time over the course of this week, Rids producing big numbers. Rob Cross has beaten Lisa Ashton. In a clash of world champions, a 6-2 success for Voltage. And Max Hopp has got the better of Dave Chisnell, 6-5 in the second round. Paul Nicholson did suggest that Dave Chisnell didn't look like he was going to make much progress today when we had him here in the first match against Ted Everts, and he's been proven right. Ninety-three. Humphreys then looking at double 16 to break straight back. Game shot. And wrestle back the lead. Michael Smith, 6-4 uh, winner against Neil Zonneveld. Christoph Ratajski has beaten Carl Wilkinson, 6-1. Darren Easy Webster fun. has edged out Kim Hybrex, and that has done a lot of damage to Kim Hybrex's world match play prospects. 58. We saw Steve West losing the first round against Jason Lowe. That has pulled Luke Humphreys 96. pretty close to Steve West in the race for the match play. West will have to rely on a good run tomorrow. Humphreys can 180. take himself above Steve West with a victory in this match. 58. Would have to go all the way to the semi-finals to be in the provisional spots at the end of today but can really aid his calls with a good run with another day's play the final day's play of the inaugural summer series tomorrow 90. and what a series it's been we've seen some real highlights have we got one for the highlight reel here bullseye Game shot. incredible stuff the finishing in this match has been Quite simply sensational. The three checkouts for Martin Clearmaker, 98, 121, and 164. 100. Each of the latter two on the bullseye. Breathless 55. stuff. 55. By far the best match of the day here on stream one. 83. Standard exceptional. Well, I don't think that he can get another one in there and not disturb that dart. It looks like it's precarious. And that's probably one of the reasons why he switched across. It also leaves it neat and tidy. 60. Hasn't missed a checkout yet. He has now. 
Humphrey should be looking at 19s here. 89. Not sure he knows what has hit him. Game shot. Ninety six. Ninety six. One hundred and eighty. Well, Humphrey's getting back in the swing of things. One hundred. One hundred and forty. It really is a game that you can't take your eyes off. Blink and you'll miss it. Darts. A pair of them are very similar in speed. Just a case of walking round and then walking straight back up to the hockey. Bullseye for Humphreys. Forty-four. We've seen his opponent pin that on a couple of occasions, but Humphreys off the mark. And finally, a checkout that 43. Martin does not threaten. Game shot. Well, it's level after eight. I tell you what, 140. this could be eight darts played, eight legs of darts played in record time. Speed darts. At the summer series. But we are no 59. closer to knowing who's going to come out on top. 140. 140. One hundred and thirty-five. Just a reminder, following this one, Daryl Gurney against Devon Peterson in the third round. One hundred and thirty-two. The winner of this match will be in the third round, back on their outside board. Game shot. Against Mensa Suljevic as Clearmaker cleans up in 11 darts with another combination checkout. And he moves one leg away. 80. 84. From a place in the last 32. 134. 180. Top tungsten. Being tossed here. 140. And it's just a shame that one of them has to lose. Luke Humphrey's determined that it's not going to be him displaying his tenacity and his talent. 100. Back to back maximums to leave himself on 61, but the 127, he will know is not safe. Double four. Game shot. And he denies his opponent a shot. And that could be very important. Little thumbs up from the cool hand of Luke Humphreys. 83. 83. He knows how good this has been. 100. Two players playing right at the top of their game. And there you see Martin Clearmaker. Averaging round about 107. Humphrey's well above the ton mark as well. 180. But the maximums may turn out to be the difference for him. He's rattled in six of the best 80. in this match. And that one in this crucial deciding leg may turn out to be the most important of the lot because Clearmaker has had a bit of a shocker as he's watched his opponent 
leave himself on a two darter after nine darts. But what a time this would be to hit back. 140. That last dart could make all the difference. To win a quite brilliant match. Humphreys wants the ball. 56. And he's just scratched the wire. We've already seen a 164 from this man. Is he going to finish it with game a 140? He does. Martin incredible Clint. end to an incredible game. Luke Humphreys, well, that has got to hurt. Not just because he's put in such a brilliant performance, but it really harms his chances of qualifying for the world match play as well.